Thousands of firefighters battling a massive Northern California wildfire were working in milder temperatures and higher humidity Monday, but the blaze that has destroyed more than 100 structures since it began five days ago continues to grow. The Park Fire, which officials said was started by a man who pushed a flaming car into a gully, grew slightly overnight to 368,000 acres, some 575 square miles. The sixth-largest wildfire in state history is rolling through a remote area some 180 miles northeast of San Francisco, according to Cal Fire. Crews were still in for quite a firefight today, just because of the sheer magnitude and the sheer size of the fire, said Dan Collins, a Cal Fire captain, noting that temperatures were to be in the high 80s with 25% humidity during the day. Trevor Skaggs, who is on a search and rescue team at the Butte County Sheriff's Office, found the Rottweilers on Saturday, alive, but tired and very thirsty, although the adult male dog did not survive. Though the remote area was not immediately accessible as the fire rapidly spread, Mr. Skaggs was flown by helicopter to a nearby point on Saturday and then ran to the location, according to police. After finding the animals, he fed them water and bites from his protein bar, before leading them back to his helicopter. The dogs were later flown to Chico Airport and are now in the care of the North Valley Animal Disaster Group, a local animal rescue organization. It's been a horrific few days for our community and we are grateful to be able to share this amazing story, the sheriff's office said.